Okay, so a uh, different student asked this question. Once we get this feature in place, how do we do that next step? Well, the first thing we want to do is you want to make sure, according to this drawing, you want to make sure that we ex uh, extrude it up to the next. So as it says over here in the, in the notes section over here, we want to take uh, that separate body and uh, on top of the finger hold, I'll be able to create another body that goes up to next. So okay, we need to start with the sketch. And we're going to go ahead and define that. So we're going to go ahead and click on this surface, go to sketch, go to sketch over here, because you can't do convert entities unless you pick this guy. And we're going to go to convert entities. What it does is that it converts uh, the things in the outside, not the inside, which is good. So that's a real quickie. Now, if you go up to features, extrude the boss space. And if we go up to up to next, oh, what, what happened there? It doesn't like it. Oh, look at that arrow. If we go up to next, it's it's going to hit next over here until it gets like over here to the edge, and then it's going to go like off the model. And there is no next. It's just an infinite universe that goes uh, nowhere. And so the model's going to go nowhere, and you're not going to be able to create a feature. But look at this box over here. If you rush your cursor in here, it says direction of extrusion, normal to profile, uh, sketch uh, 102. But really, the key words here are direction of extrusion. And so if we click inside of that and click on that tangent line again, remember this design sketch is driving our whole uh, model here. We're going to go and click on that. Now watch what happens. Now we have that coming right up to the edge. So not only do we put this, uh, this uh, handle top uh, in the right location, right on that uh, sketch over here, but when we did this extrusion, it's right on uh, that edge too. So it's going to be continuous from the frame holds to the handle top to the extrusion that connects them all. That's how you want to do it. And when you do that, go to the green check mark, bang, it's all set to go. And the last thing you need to do is just put a fillet in there, kind of round that out, and that portion of the model's uh, complete.